As mentioned in the business cycle video, humans aren't robots. Greed is one of the desires which make us imperfect, and it's precisely greed that fuels asset bubbles. During a bubble, the price of an asset goes up sharply over a certain period of time, but then collapses. Strangely enough, the first recorded asset bubble involved tulips. The tulip mania, as it was called, peaked all the way back in 1637. Lots of other asset bubbles took place as of that point, involving stocks, real estate, and so on. Regardless of which asset we're talking about, though, bubbles tend to follow a similar pattern. 1. An asset starts gradually becoming more and more popular among experienced investors. 2. As the popularity of the asset grows, less experienced investors start joining the party. 3. Eventually, prices grow so much that the asset starts receiving attention among regular people. You hear about it in the media, during casual conversations, and so on. At this point, even people who know next to nothing about investing want a piece of the action. 4. As of a certain point, the price increase can no longer be sustained and people start panic selling. Prices drop sharply, but some investors are still in denial. They think the fall is just temporary, so the drop eventually stops for a while and prices may even start rising a bit. 5. Finally though, as more and more investors start losing confidence in the asset, prices collapse for good. 